Greetings everybody, this is Thungan or Thungi. I built something new in this world. I wanted to show it off real quick in a video because I am very happy with it. Um, so next to my sheep farms, uh, this is sort of next to um, one of my older bases from some older episodes. Um, I added a sorting system for what will be all the different colored items in the game. Um, right now it is sorting the wool though and you can see it flying through the air in the sky. Hi kitty, you crawl up onto my lap just at the time I started talking, probably because I did start talking. Um, and uh, then it flows along a water stream through all the multiple layers. You can kind of see it going through these second layers and thirds as the colors filter out. You can see this is where lime will filter out. Pink, blue, gray. Um, I swapped some of the layers around, but one of the layers is a grayscale layer. One of the layers is my favorite color layer, and then there's a, the redder, warmer colors, and then the bluer, colder colors that are remaining um, on each of these layers. Um, and uh, I think it's pretty cool how this turned out. Um, so each of these wools so get sorted to these spots, and uh, sorted this way. And of course, why would I make a huge tower like that? One, because it's fun, and two, because these are not the only things that are going to be stored in the structures. So I'm actually going to have uh, the walls here. Um, I won't have a sorting system for them, but I'm going to have the concretes as well, the terracottas, the glass, and the dyes based on each of the 16 colors that are in the, the dyeable colors in this game. So they'll be sorted and stored or sorted automatically the wools and stored the rest of the stuff on each of these layers and so the idea is that once it's built up which would be um, on some future streams um, I could fly into this part of the world uh, into the light blue area and then I could grab my light blue wool from these chests or um, light blue terracotta light blue glass things like that um, so yeah, if we wanted to take a closer look. Um, um, so the wolves themselves. Um, oh my goodness, my cat is tugging at me. What do you want? Okay. They, they come from this automatic sheep farm um, here. Um, you just need to make sure it's restocked with shears. Um, I just put a bunch in, so it should be going for a while. And then I'll show you the mechanics in there soon. Um, once I release the flood, I have a backlog of flood in there that I want to release. So they come along the water stream, and then they fly straight up to the top. And I didn't even mean for this to happen, but I just saw it just now, and I think it's super cool. Um, they actually come flying out of the water before they land back in, and then they just end up going along these paths here. It goes over the first four hoppers for the sorting system, the grayscale ones. Um, and this, if you don't know, this is a basic sorting system. Um, this top chest or this top hopper only looks to collect black wool or filler seeds, um, since no seeds are going to be coming in through this system with the specific name. Um, you won't have to worry about that. So it's only looking for black wool. Um, and when black wool enters, um, it will reach 42. And that is just enough items for this comparator to detect to go from 2 power to strength to 3 power, which would turn on this repeater, turn off a redstone torch here, and it will let this hopper collect the items from above it. Um, and it will collect just one black wool, and then it will turn it off again. So this hopper here actually stays full full enough so that the black wool stays inside of there um, and then the second hopper sorts it down into the chest of course um, and it does that for each of the colors um, it goes around this water system and then drops down to the next level um, down to right there you can see one just landed and then it goes around these four colors before it drops down to the next if it hasn't found its proper color yet you get it and it goes on and on. Um, one last level, one last drop down um, to these colors here. And the best thing about this is that it will only collect the 16 more colors if anything extra comes through. It will enter up in this chest. 
It can also enter up in this chest if too much of it happens all at once. So each one of these collects 41, right? Um, if it goes over 64, um, it cannot collect anymore. So it goes on to this if it's just going too fast. I don't know why I have this gray one here. Um, but I think I'm going to get a bunch when I release these floodgates because it's just going to flood up too fast. Um, but what I mean by that is the previous storage is just stored right beneath here. Um, this is where the wool goes through. Um, it all enters the suspenser, which uses the exact same clock as what the shears use to shear the sheep. Um, and then it, uh, this is all extra storage from before. So if I release the floodgates, um, I think if I put random colors in here, um, it would choose one randomly instead of just one uh, of the same color back to back and flood up my system. Um, so I'll just put all these in here. Um, and meanwhile, I could even just grab this chest and put a chest up here. And put all the wool in here instead. I am grabbing them all. Oh yeah, from there. Okay. Uh, I was grabbing them through the corner there. Um, which makes sense to me. Um, and I have all of this wool down here as well. A whole bunch more. And so... Yes, that's what I want. I'm being grabbed by the water stream. So let's watch this in action. Grab all my wool from before. Don't worry about me drowning. Because I am good. Um, we'll just put my extra stuff in here real quick. That's a little be a little bit easier, but don't worry about that. Um, uh, what I want to take a look at um, I could be able to grab this last chest and we can look at it in action going full force. It won't be like this up all the time because um, oh, I took off my breathing armor. That is also true. Okay. So let's go take a look at what this looks like. So you can see this is just non-stop now. Uh, you can see each of the layers going. And of course, <laughs> that looks so cool. I wonder if I'm getting any loss up there. I should double check that off uh, camera, making sure it's all landing back in the water so I can collect it all again. Um, not landing on top of the glass up there. You can see it all getting sorted, uh, going through each of the layers. Um, you can see each layer has less and less because that's all that's left for those layers. Um, oh man, that looks so cool. Yes, yes. Um. And let's make sure it's quite laggy right now while it does all this. Yes, it is all going. It's spaced out enough, choosing random colors enough not to overwhelm the system. And soon all of these holes will be in the system itself. Uh, let's look at it during the day too.
That looks cool. Man, I could watch this for a while. I did spend a lot of time building this, so I deserve... To look how cool this is. Uh, and if, yeah, if we ever need a ton of a specific color, um, I have these sheep over there, and I could connect to a second water stream, connect to the same system. And there are wolves in those chests that will be filtered into this massive storage system too. Um, I'm trying to basically spring clean my world, consolidate the different special storage systems like this. So um, it's just a cleaner, neater world to use. So if I needed um, wool or colored stuff for a project like a mini golf course over there, I could come to one place to get it all. Um, and this is more of a central part of my world, so I can actually do that pretty easily. Um, and yeah, I think I will end it here with a nice view right here. So, uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, catch me on my streams. I'm mostly be doing this on stream, but I will do occasional update videos. My twice or three times a year videos, you know, um, as you've seen on my channel. Um, uh, I'm a pretty inconsistent streamer too, maybe once a week, but uh, that is where you might catch me too. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.